줄 모르고 나 혼자 Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a Q&A and I haven't done a Q&A in quite a while, maybe like a month or two, maybe even three. I posted a picture on Instagram and asked you guys um, to comment some questions. I have over 201 right now, so let's see how this goes. So first question is from Joan underscore row and she asked current obsessions right now um i'm obsessed with k-pop singing cover accounts and i've been of course into watching dance cover accounts but i currently just like i just like found so many good instagram singers and i love them to death they're my bays. i love them so much and their voices are amazing i'm gonna try to remember a couple in my head right now but um there's kyung covers kai covers kai su covers um k covers to um, I can't remember more on top of my head, but those are like my bays at the moment. I like freaking love their singing covers. You guys have to check them out. I'll leave all their um, users right here and down below in the description. So be sure to follow them and they don't know about the shout out. So if you guys are watching this right now, I love you and your voices are my gold. You guys are my queens and I love you. So I just love their singing covers. So that's my current obsession at the moment. Next question is from Florisa or K-pop booty and she asked bias list and I'm not gonna share my full K-pop bias list, but I'll share maybe my top five biases. I don't know, let's just go. Okay, so who is my ultimate bias? And then all of EXO. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're number two right there. And then we have uh, Sungyeon, Shonu, Mark, and J-Hope. Yeah, I think we're good. I'm not gonna share any more biases. I got this a lot, but this is gonna be specifically from uh, Hobie Hoon. I think, yeah, she, yeah, we're gonna go with she. Um, asks, what's your height? And I am 5'3", and I think and a half probably now, or 3'4". I'm taller than my mom, and she's 5'3", so I think I'm like almost 5'4". But yeah, I grew a little bit since my last height, I told you guys, which was like probably like 5'1", or something. Next question is exo bias list from Rachel underscore Cho, 912 or 912. And okay, we're gonna do this, ready? Sehun, all of them. If we're gonna go technicals, then I go Sehun. And then number two place is Baekhyun Dio, Kai, Chanyeol, Chris. I'm gonna count Chris. Chris Luhan. And then number three, Suho, Human Chen, Lei, Tao. Yeah, that's how I do it. I go one, two, and three. Next question is makeup or K pop from. Mm, hmm, how do I say this? Kyla? Maybe. Kyla.x. Oh, God. Well, I wear makeup every day. I listen to K-pop every day. So I don't know how that works out. K-pop makeup, boom. Next question is from Lee Bunnies or Lib Bunnies. And she asked, why don't you do your hair? Well, as you guys know, I don't ever, like I don't ever do anything with my hair in my videos. It's always down because my hair does not like to curl and keep a curl and it doesn't look good. Sometimes and I'm just not a hair guru, so I just I, I just leave it. I just let it be. This is my natural hair. I just brush it, flip it around, spoof it up. That's all I need to do. Next question is from I Jennifer Wing, and she asked, "Are you learning Korean or planning on learning Korean?" I am learning Korean. I can read it all. I may not pronounce it correctly, but I can read Korean. Um, but I do have like a Korean phrase book. I try to learn somehow, you know, by reading subtitles and then drama. I kind of just pick up what they're saying. I, I can basically watch an 80% translated drama. Like I can make up what they're saying or trying to say. From Helen Opa, and you guys need to follow her on Instagram because Helen Opa, oh my god, Helen, you are bae if you're watching this. I love you and your selfies are my freaking life. You need to like go shopping with me. I freaking love your clothes, okay? Um, but she asked, how would your life be if you didn't start YouTube and learning to do makeup? I wouldn't be wearing makeup. I'd probably have like a tinted lip balm maybe. But if I didn't start YouTube, I wouldn't have a lot of my YouTube friends. I, my life would be pretty boring. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't be as um, open and outgoing as I am now. Before I was really, really shy. I didn't have... I didn't have like, I wasn't friends with every single person in the grade, but now pretty much everyone knows who I am. Uh, I guess my life would be a little um, less exciting, I think. Next question is, I think, hold up, Ileana Stasia. I think that's how you say it. But she asked, do you like Infinite? And if so, who's your bias in that group? My bias is Sungyeol. He's my bias. Yeah. 
And I think I got this a couple times, but I'm just gonna go with this specific one that I see right now. But from official underscore Alex Joe or Joe, she asked, "What steps do you do to learn a new K-pop song?" I'm. I think she means dance because I don't really sing that much. But um, for dancing, I got I have a lot of questions from you guys on Instagram asking me how I learn K-pop dances, and I'm not the best, of course. I'm not like a pro or anything. I'm not like Nikes or something. But um, for me, I just search up a mirrored version of the dance, and then I stand somewhere or kind of just like do the movements in place. I like spot it basically in place, and then I stand up. Um, in an open space and I tried the dance out but 50% slower you can change the speed on YouTube videos through a laptop or a computer I guess some of you guys don't know that or a lot of people don't know that but you go to settings and then there's a speed and it says normal but you can go 2.5 which is half the speed and you just slow it down and you do the movements and then you turn it to normal when you feel confident and I just do it I don't really have a mirror at all uh, but I have my phone camera and that's what I look at and then I look at the um, how I did it and then ta-da that's how I learn next question comes from Kelly 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 covers and she's one of my favorite singing accounts but she asked favorite EXO performance and favorite song at the moment and are you ever going to audition for a company by the way I love you I love you too and my favorite EXO performance is um, Mama 2013 when they did growl and then favorite song at the moment the past two days I've been really liking trespass and there's one other song by Monster X um, well, of course, I still I, I love the whole entire um, repackaged Love Me Right album thing because of Tender Love, it's amazing. But I've been obsessing over Monster X's. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I've been loving that song a lot. And are you ever gonna audition for a company? Hopefully, if I'm not lazy and if I have the confidence to, I might. Most likely, I might, may, yeah, will. I don't know why, but a lot of you guys asked me if I had a boyfriend. I don't, okay? I don't have a boyfriend. I don't know how that went through your mind to think that I how is that even a question to be a boyfriend? Sorry, I'm actually married to Sahoon, so I don't know what you guys are talking about, so. From Paradise, Senpai noticed me. I noticed you. Okay, I can't raise my eyebrows, but Eileen, I love you. Next question comes from Shalom. Sh Shalom. Just two M's, underscore. And asks, uh, can, you can you have some tips to improve my confidence? Um, so give you some tips, uh, because I think I have a lot of talent, but I just, I'm just afraid to show it. Um, well, um, I was afraid myself to start YouTube as well as doing dance covers on you, um, on Instagram, but I just thought to myself, there's no harm in showing my qualities, even if I'm bad or if I get hate. It's just, I want to share it, so I'm just going to share it, see what happens. I just... I'm just like, I want to do it. You know, you only live once, as cheesy as that sounds, but you just got to do it. You do it, you see how it goes, and you get confidence that way. I see, when I posted my first dance cover, I was not confident. I was like, this probably sucks, but you know, let's just see. I want some feedback to get better anyway, so I just posted it, and then I got some positive feedback. I got more confident, and now I do dance covers all the time. I can learn them a little faster because of the positive feedback and the tips I get, so just go for it, and then you build the confidence um, in the long Long run um, along the way so yeah I get this question almost every single video actually and then er like a lot of you um, Instagram comments as well but um, underscore grace Liao I don't know how to say that but she asked how do you make your skin so light and I guess you guys watched my old videos from last year where I was super super tan but that's because I tan easily in the summertime and then I get pale and lighter in the winter time and it just it's a cycle guys it just it just happens naturally I don't burn so I tan a lot in the summertime and then it gets lighter because it's cold outside I don't go outside as much um, but I'm trying to keep my not so tan skin by am getting tan but I wear SPF every single day on my face because my BB cream has SPF I don't know how much is in there but I wear sunscreen every single day and I try to put it on my body as well 
Um, and I also don't go out in the sun too much. You see, you need to go outside to be, you know, get active and stuff. I don't stay out for too long. Um, of course, I don't use any self-tanner. And I also, for my face, I use a light UV cream and set it with a matching powder. So it just blends in with my neck and I look lighter. Um, but if any of my, like, non-Asian uh, entertainment enthusiasts are watching me and you guys don't understand why I'm trying to be lighter, uh, well, I... You know how people prefer to be tanner, they put on self-tan. I prefer to be lighter, so I use lighter products and stuff. And I don't use any whiteners or anything, because um, I don't really have any of those products. But, um, yeah, that's what I do. From, uh, um, I'm not gonna, Lychia Vua? Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry for butchering that, but she asked, uh, Pretend there is no Sehun in EXO, who would be your bias. Well, if Sehun wasn't there, then that would mean Kai, Dio, Baekhyun, Chanyeol, Chris, Luhan. I gotta choose one from one of them, right? I feel like Baekhyun... No, Kai! Wait, back. Dio... No, um... I can't choose. I'm sorry. Just no. no. Next question is from Lexi Lulu. 411 and she asked would you like to have a fan meetup and I love you I love you too and I would love to have a meetup um, with my viewers um, you guys my best friends on the internet anyway I would love to have a fan meetup um, but there's not I don't know where you guys live and if people would come so but I would love to meet you guys so much I would just <laughs> hugs everywhere like an actual hug not a virtual hug so yeah. And that ends my Q&A for today. Sorry that was kind of long, but I love answering you guys' questions. So if you guys want me to do more Q&As or if you guys want to be more, or if you guys want to be featured in my next Q&A, be sure to follow me on Instagram because that's where I usually get my questions. But you can also follow me on Twitter. And if I have enough followers on there, I'll maybe do a Twitter Q&A as well. Um, but here are my links. Follow me on those two social networks. And also follow me on my dancing Instagram or my cover Instagram at Ulisha or Lisa. But, but the S is actually an X, so it's like Ulisha. Anyway, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please request more summer videos for me to do down below. And I will see you guys in my next one. I love you guys. Bye.